Dealing with Ota, did his song then. We chose a round it. Which means we're probably gonna have to go back and choose a different route. Eventually. I know it was dangerous to sink past the time limit. That was my fault, and I'm sorry. Are you really sorry? Yes. Then you owe me some Dom P at my favorite club in Kabuki Cho. Or you can lick my shoes. Either or. Dom P. Actually, I was kind of a freak. I might lick the shoes. It's all right. As I mentioned earlier, both your brainwaves are normal. However, I'm sure there was some overload. You should go home and get some rest. Been better. I'm still a little drowsy. What about your stab wound? My what? Oh, oh, it hurts. It started acting up suddenly. Ow! It's because you grabbed me and forced me to come here, Date. Don't blame me. That was boss. I'll sue you for this. Oh, come on. Nor. How about this? Get me one of the straws Tessa used, and I won't sue you. Hey, yo? I respect the hustle, but goddamn Ota. I see Ota is no. back to his healthy self. Guess so. Because I was scared. Scared? The killer could come here to finish the job. But you didn't get a good look at their face, right? But they don't know that. I had it prepared just in case. You know what I'm talking about, right, Date? Preparing in advance in case you might need it. Like making sure your room is nice and clean before you go to a party. Oh, sorry. You probably don't have any experience with that. You are not about to lecture me on bringing girls back to my room, you virgin. I have more experience than you. Ota, let me ask you something. When you were fighting the polar bear back at the warehouse, did the crane hook get stuck on the polar bear's leg? Now that you mention it, maybe it did. Maybe? It's like I told you, I don't really remember much. With all the tension and excitement and fear and adrenaline, my mind just went blank. But now that we're talking about it, I remember. Yeah. No doubt about it. The crane hook got stuck on the polar bear's left leg. And then, when the hook got pulled out, blood sprayed all over. So the blood at the crime scene should be not just Ota's, but also whoever was in the suit. Date, I checked all of the hospitals in the metropolitan area. None have a record of a patient admitted after 3 a.m. with a wound to the left leg. If what I saw in Somnium is how it happened in real life, that was a deep wound. He definitely would have needed first aid. Perhaps a friend or accomplice helped them. You think there are multiple killers? That is not what I said. They may have helped the culprit, but not necessarily been involved in the crimes. So we know that the culprit has a deep wound on their left leg. That information could be crucial in catching them. Date, get out there. Look for people with an injured left leg. How exactly? Can't you just go ask around or something? Are you serious? Do you know how many people live in this city? A lot. <sighs> what? Dude. Junky? Are we drunk? What is the matter? We're vibing. That's what's the matter. Are you all right? <laughs> Fuck was that? 
Maybe we reach a new day. Hey, Nurse Mizuki. <gasps> hey, this is. Oh, you're alive. Mizuki? What happened? You drank too much at the club and passed out. Liar. I remember everything until I collapsed in the control room. You did something dangerous during the sink last night, didn't you? Your brain got overloaded and you passed out. That's what Pewter and Boss said. You met them? They brought you over. They said to let you sleep it off because you were tired from the investigation. Aww. Nothing looks different. I'm off today. Why? Today is Tuesday. You should have school. You really can be an insensitive jerk, can't you? Taking the day off for morning. Oh yeah, good point. <laughs> she has had a few people in her life die. Oh, Dante's brain is rotting away. He won't last long now. You should probably prepare for a funeral soon. So they told you I'm completely fine, huh? Detect no noticeable damage to your brain. You should not have any issue continuing the investigation. He probably went back to the hospital. Boss told Mizuki about Ota being synced. And about what happened at the cold storage warehouse. Why did she tell her all that? Mizuki was asking about the status of the investigation. The girl has lost both her parents. I am sure Boss felt that she deserved to know. Eh, yeah, fair enough. Hey, will you take me with you? I told you yesterday, yes, let's take... No, we take her with us. I won't put you in danger like that. But you're close to catching the culprit, right? The killer has an injury on their left leg. Boss said you need to find them. Let me help you. No, you stay here. Dante, don't you know how I feel? My parents are dead. I saw their bodies with my own eyes. If I don't do something, I'm going to go crazy. Dante. Take, take her. Please. Take her with. Bring back the, the third best investigating partner in the game. Date, consider Mizuki's feelings. She is lonely. Mizuki has not been with Renju and Shoko for four years, but clearly she still feels a bond to them, a bond that was broken by the murderer. With her parents gone, Mizuki has almost no one. She can only depend on one person now. You know to whom I am referring. Yes. Fine, let's go. You're gonna take me? Yeah. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you, Date. Let's go. Here. Ow. Wipe your tears. We're heading out. Date, I must admit, I am at a disadvantage. The clue that the culprit is injured on their left leg does not help me narrow down suspects significantly. We need to revisit the scene. Let's just go wander around the city and like shove people from the right side, see what happens. See if they can it's catch possible themselves. I don't know. find the culprit at one of the crime scenes. Or ask around the city for further information. Explore to Oh bro, we gotta go everywhere? Jesus Christ. Alright. Date and Mizuki, off on adventures again. I remember telling you before, that Bloom Park is an important part of my memories. Before it shut down, I came here a lot with Daddy and Mom. They fought a lot, but sometimes they got along. 
Whenever we were here, it was one of those sometimes days. I remember it clearly. There's been so many routes and everything. I can't remember if we have found the phone inside the horse in this route. I don't think we have because I think it belonged to Renju in like the far right side route. Like I think in this far right side route. So in all these right paths, Renju is not dead here or as far as we know down any of that path. Renju dies here on this side. In the in this side the phone and the horse is Renju's. So I don't know if something would change over here. I was just a little girl, but it was so rare to see them laughing together. That's why I remember it so well. I remember riding the merry-go-round like this. Mom was standing right next to me. She was holding me so I wouldn't fall. Last Friday, God. I don't, I don't think clicking on stuff's gonna help right now. I think it's just talk to her. Daddy was on the outside taking pictures of me and mom. He was on the other side of the fence with an old camera. Every time we passed in front of him, Mom and I would wave our hands. <laughs> we sound like a happy family, huh? He must have gotten good pictures. No, actually. We tried developing them at the park, but they came out all blurry and out of focus. But Mom wasn't mad or upset or anything. She just started laughing. That might have been the first and last time the three of us laughed out loud together. I couldn't get on many of them because I was so little, but I did ride the Ferris wheel and the panda ride. They're kind of tame now, but at the time they were really fun. I was having so much fun it felt wrong. Like it was too good to be true. Other than last Friday? Nope, I haven't. This place has been off limits for almost a decade. Even if it wasn't, I don't think I would want to come back here. Why is that? How can I explain it? I guess I just wanted to keep that memory beautiful. I didn't want to ruin it or replace it with another. But in the end, it was replaced with the worst memory possible. Hmm. Hey, Date, how do you define family? Define it? You mean like being blood related? That would mean you and I could never be family. Well, I guess. Nah, that's we're okay. family. It's nah, okay. We're family. This is what I think a family is. A perfectly ordinary relationship in the most ordinary way. Huh? Like, you say, I'm home, and you get a welcome home back. Doing those ordinary things automatically, without even thinking about it, is what a family is. That's why maybe me and mom and daddy weren't able to be a family. Our whole lives, we never could be ordinary. Even if I tried my hardest to be normal, it would just be awkward, eventually. I got tired of trying. I killed them. What? I killed mom and daddy. What? The fuck, Mizuki? I... I was never a good girl. I didn't listen to mom. I couldn't do ordinary things. That's why mom hit me. And why mom and daddy didn't get along. And why they got divorced. Then mom had to start working and start doing business with dangerous people. Oh, thank fuck that's what you mean. Thank fuck that's what you mean. If I was just okay. a good girl, mom wouldn't have been killed. This, okay. all of this, is all my fault. I was worried she was on some actual literal shit. For half a second, I was like, what? 
Date, give her a hug, man. Why me? Hey, haven't you had enough? Why me? Is this like the first time we've seen an actual like living version of Joko? Like her talking and alive in this game? No, I'm not married. So take this with a grain of salt, but it's not just you, right? Doesn't every family have a tough time raising children? Our child is abnormal. Abnormal? Ever since she was a baby, no child should cry at night as much as she did. No child should dislike buggy rides that much. No child should ask to be picked up and hugged all the time. She's still abnormal even now. Other children would have learned to clean up after themselves by now. They would be studying, going to bed on time, waking up on time. God damn. Sounds like you're a bad parent. She's my little girl. She sounds like a normal kid to me. Maybe the problem isn't with Mizuki. Maybe it's you. Chad I'm Dante doing more than anyone. Our child is stupid, brain dead, abnormal. Date, honey, you can't work her up like that. Mama, you know I'm right. We can ask questions in the flashback? You sure you aren't drinking too much, honey? If you pass out, there's no way I can control her. I think she's loaded. Let her get this off her chest. Hey, Shoko. No, no. No, no, no. There, I scolded her. Mama, not helpful. Sleeping at home, not knowing that her mother is crying her eyes out because of her. Oh, God damn. I quit my job for that girl. I threw away the career that I built with my own hands. I raised my child at the expense of my own life. But one little slap. Yeah, that's what a mother does. Are you hitting your kid? There's nothing I can do. I have no choice. I know you should never raise oh your my hand God. to a child. Fuck this bitch. I know that. Glad I know she's that. Dead, honestly. But I have a good reason. She doesn't listen to me. So what else am I supposed to do? Listen to her. What the hell do you mean, what am I supposed to do? That's no reason to hit a child. So of course she starts crying. And it's so irritating that I have to hit her again to get her to stop. And Mizuki cries and cries some more. Why are you crying? If you're gonna cry, why didn't you just listen to me in the first place? Then I wouldn't have to hit you. Oh my lord. Stupid Mizuki. Stupid Fuck girl. this bitch. It's not my fault. Everything it is, is your her fault. fault. Have you talked to Renju about this? I'm trying. I'm trying harder than anyone. Why doesn't anyone see that? Why doesn't anyone understand? <laughs> Date. you. Yeah, I'll talk to Renju about this. Oh my god. Oh, fuck her mom for that, dude. What? It was my misunderstanding. What do you mean? Oh, what I the hell? Mothers love their children unconditionally. But some mothers just can't do that. Well, no. Maybe she does love her. But she has a hard time of it. Shoko was never hugged by her mother. Not because her mother wasn't around. She was raised to never develop a sensitivity to affection. No hugs, no piggyback rides, nothing. Maybe that's why she doesn't know how to love Mizuki. When an animal raised in captivity gives birth, sometimes it just doesn't know how to raise its young. It's just like that. I mean, it's facts. That's, that's true, I guess. When you two are done talking, that's when I'll close up. Sorry about this. I'm not going to let you set up a joke. Listen to Ren's story. Aw, Mama, you're Why are you fabulous, asking though. me about raising a child, hmm? Yeah, good point. Really? You're not even going to say, Oh no, Mama, you'd be a great mother. You would. You'd be fabulous. But that doesn't mean she's blameless in all this. 
Someone has to put a stop to it. If I could have, I would have done it a long time ago. What about counseling? I did recommend that. She told me, I'm not sick. Why should I go see a doctor? Mizuki is the problem. Mizuki is the sick one. Oh, she's not. She's 12. She's like four in this flashback, I'm assuming. No, Mizuki would never leave Shoko. She wouldn't hear of it. Mizuki and Shoko are practically attached at the hip. Even with all of the hitting? Yes. Even if she's abused on a daily basis, even if she's treated like garbage... Maybe. Mizuki is hungry for love. She craves praise and attention and physical affection. She wants it from her mother. That's why she's so attached. Okay. I have a company now. Lemniscate. And we're at a crucial stage of development. I can't take even a single second out of my day to deal with a kid. Hey, that's your daughter I'm you're talking about. You. Maybe because you two can't cooperate on raising a child, Shoko is having trouble coping. Behind every troubled child is some shit parents. That might be it. Maybe this is partially my fault. Okay, I'm sorry, but I'm just gonna say it. You two are both awful parents. Chad Date has returned. We have our, we have our, we have our likable protagonist back. I knew about the whole thing. That's why four years ago, I decided to start taking care of Mizuki. Mizuki, you did nothing wrong. Don't blame You're yourself. Hug, bro. It's not your fault. Not one single thing was your fault. <laughs> Give her a hug, dude. This ain't the story about a murder. This is the story about fixing fixing a broken little girl. Huh? Why are we at the shrine? To get the fruit of immortality for oh, Iris. Did you come here to pray that you find the criminal? No, I don't believe in God. Wow, how edgy teen of you. Don't call me a teen. You're 12. Well, you said that you got the shoulders of a 40-year-old. That's not even remotely similar. So why are we really here? I sometimes come here when an investigation stalls. It helps me think. Sometimes I even solve the case from here. This is a quiet, peaceful little spot in the middle of a violent city. It's calming. It keeps all of the bad thoughts away. Didn't expect you to be such a poet. You could at least call me a romantic. Same thing. They're not at all the same thing. It's the difference between someone who's frugal and someone who's cheap. You're stubborn about weirdly specific things. Yes, a tree. Choyuza. Why do these dog statues always have one with its mouth open and one with its mouth closed? Good question. Maybe the one with his mouth open is going, ah, uh, and the one with his mouth closed is going, um. <laughs> You're the one who asked. <laughs> What does it say? When riding on a train, people on opposite sides of the car doors shouldn't stare at each other. That's what it says. That is definitely a lie. It's it's something that is very truthful, though. Hey, Mizuki, do you think you could fit your hand into the box there? Hey, Date, are you really a cop? Yeah, kind of. Are right, we here to talk to Mizuki? Coming here reminds me of when I trained you. Yeah. It's been a while since we came here last. 
Oh yeah, we put I you on the weight training more team. To teach you. Let us see the results of your training. Leave it to me. She's about to demolish those dummies, bro. Begin. God, oh my lord. Saitama who? Well, this is on you. Huh? Hey! What are you two doing? Mizuki, run for it! Uh, wait for me! Yes, best parent, Dante. <laughs> By the way, whatever happened to those kids who bullied you? Oh, did I not tell you? No, you beat the I shit haven't out said of anything about it. I didn't want to pry. They stopped bugging me as soon as I threatened to fight back. They targeted some other kids instead. They did terrible things. So I... I broke all their front teeth. Jeez. That a girl. Hey, since we're here, let's go into the shrine. I told you, I don't believe in that stuff. Come on, come on! Have we actually gone into the shrine? We've just kept sitting outside of it every time. Ah, oh, this is what she means. Never mind, I thought we were going in the building, in the building. To leave this boring place as soon as possible. To cure Iris's stage four brain tumor. <laughs> it's a secret. When you tell people your wish, it won't come true. Then why did you ask me? Because if your dream doesn't come true, mine is more likely to. You're more crooked than a hernia. Huh? Anyway, where to next? The map tells us the cold storage warehouse is next, Mizuki. I don't know. Is Mizuki going to overtake Iris as second best investigating partner? Should I even be counting Aiba? She feels like counting Aiba is almost cheating. She's like the default as best investigating partner. This is where Iris and Ota almost got killed, right? And did get killed in other, t in other timelines, correct. Gives me goosebumps. You scared? That's rare. You need to chill. You need to get better jokes. Oh, I understand. Chill, meaning both cold and relax. A pun intended. Don't explain it, it's embarrassing. Good job, Iba. Alright, Mizuki, so this is my best friend, Kagami. <laughs> No shadow back here this time. Equipment. Forklift. Hey, Mizuki, could you move that forklift? <laughs> what did you say about the ice cream machine? Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna need that hook down. What would happen if I put you in that box and then soaked it in gasoline and then lit it on fire? I'd, I'd die, die, obviously. Well, you couldn't fit me in the box anyway. Oh. I'll just cut you into pieces then. Don't joke about that sort of thing in this game. That'll definitely happen. What would happen if I put you in that box and then dropped a five ton weight on it? I'd die, obviously. Jeez, do you want to kill me? I would collect a lot of insurance. Are you signed on to my insurance? Girl, you, both your parents just died. You have had enough insurance. Ota was down around here, right? Correct. The bloodstains there must belong to Ota. Correct. They don't necessarily all belong to Ota, though. No, 
Wait. But That's where the polar bear's tail. leg was pierced by the hook. Nothing in it. Yeah. You cold? Could I have your jacket? Oh, wait. Never mind. That jacket probably hasn't been washed in years. Who said I'd give it to you anyway? Don't disregard good intentions so casually. Mizuki is a quick thinker. You are her father figure now. You should praise her so she matures. I don't want her to mature. She's trouble enough as it is. Huh? What do you mean? This is Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse. I know you said Renju doesn't own it or anything, but I thought maybe you might have seen it before. No, not at all. Really? Yes, stop being annoying. Why would I lie about that? I don't know. Alright. Time for round <laughs> 17. Oh, wait. I remember. It was Kagami, right? What did you say? Oh, sorry. My fault. Must be mistaken. No. No! You're exactly right. How? What's the matter with you? Sorry, I just get so emotional sometimes. Aw, could you stand up on your left leg? This guy is kind of weird. Could you stand up on your left leg fully, my guy? I need to see if you're, uh... If you're fully balanced on that left leg there, Kagami. You're right, Mizuki. Stay away. Huh? What? There are a lot of weirdos out there. If you get a bad feeling, trust your instincts and don't get too close. Yeah, the game is basically saying to my face hey. right now that Kagami is the bad guy. This might sound weird coming from me, but don't push yourself too hard, okay? Thank you for caring. Homie is literally it's a lot. Homie has literally been kneeling down on his left leg both times that we've been back here to investigate. Sus as fuck. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just totally forgot. Date, sir. Hmm? What is it? Oh, he this stood up. Is how it's supposed to be. Never mind. He stood up. He's fine. A man like you doesn't have to remember the names of people like me. But we're co-workers. We both work for the MPD. Isn't it rude to not remember your name? No, no, not at all. It has to be this way. All right. If you say so. Yeah, no, he just took a knee like Kaepernick back in 2016 there. He's fine. Or he's just grunting through the pain. Well, I don't dislike it. Of course, yeah, depending on the case, sometimes it does get pretty discouraging. But that just makes the job all the more important, right? It means it really makes a difference in the world. You're a great guy. You should learn from him. Do you know why I do this job? What keeps me going? I will never learn from Kagami. He is my nemesis. I heard you became a cop so you could steal underwear from the gym and not get in trouble. Who told you that? I'll show them trouble. No, not so far. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Maybe in a previous life we... Taro. You must be Taro, right? No, I'm not Taro. Can't believe it. Date, a bit of blood stain here is not from a single person. Yep, we got Two a blood cocktail. Two different blood types are present. One of them is most likely Ota's, the other. Hey, do you have DNA forensics on that blood stain? Of course, yeah. I already sent it to the lab to be analyzed. I'm just waiting to hear back. Why are you waiting? Oh, sick. Because that blood is from Ota Matsushita's wound, right? I didn't think there was any need to rush the results. Tell them we need it analyzed urgently. Highest priority. The culprit's blood is mixed with Ota's. Yes, sir. Understood. Hey, yo. Let's go. You did it, Date. We're making progress. If this goes well, we can yes, identify sir. the criminal with a single test. But it might take some time for the results to come out. No point waiting here. We might as well check somewhere else. Got it. Sir, yes sir. Big detective work stuff. 
God damn, still got five things left to do today. What are we doing here? Oh yeah, the receptionist likes us in this timeline, right? Sometimes we would talk when I came over to hang out. What kind of things did you talk about? Nothing special. The usual. The usual? Are you doing well? Have you been eating right? Huh. So that's the usual. Mizuki. Could you go to the office? Ask them if they've seen anyone with an injured left leg. Got it. All right. Ah? Looks like it didn't go well. No. Hold up on that real second. Real important Two. questions. Well, of course it would be two cups. Three cups would be a nightmare. Makes sense. Date, why are you Makes asking sense. that? Police work. We're trying to solve our case, Ms. <laughs> this is embarrassing. But okay. Seriously? Really? Yeah. Date, what are you doing? Sorry, what? Does this have anything to do with the investigation? Uh, no. Ow. Huh? What? What are you doing? I'm putting the investigation I'm... on hold. I'm going to Atami with her. I've made up my mind. You can't stop me. Side effects of the medication. This is acute brain failure. What medication do I have? Wait, are you serious? Do I look like I'm joking? Date, you're being annoying again. Do you know how angry I can get, Date? Oh my god. Let's go to a go. Uh, Okay. What? 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 What is happening? Well, we did it. <laughs> we reached the good end. <laughs> we did the good ending. Oh, carnival worth it. Ah, oh, sick. Great, great, great game. Good story. <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> What's it? I think that's the second time it's done that to me. That's funny though. Ah, fine. Don't make me restart at the beginning though. Wait, do I need to click reopen investigation to not start at the beginning? Fuck. Oh my god. Ah, oh, my bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Skip, skip, skip. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I apologize for this. <laughs> Skip, skip, skip. God, gotta go through all that shit again. Am I supposed to reopen investigation when it gives me that option then?
do, 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 do. Then we talk to Renju. Speed run in this. Pocket. Huh? We haven't been to Sunfish before. What? Yeah, I didn't find any clues. Because this is where Daddy's corpse was? I told you before, it's fine. I was the one who said I wanted to come with you. Um, not really. Yeah, nothing we can do here. Going? I guess it doesn't make us redo the, uh... The bloodstain thing. And the Lumnus Gate visit. I guess they probably were like Sunfish Pocket there where they didn't have much going on other than dialogue shit. Still weird though. Still weird that it made me go back and do Bloom Park, but I guess the flashbacks are important to the storyline in some capacity. And Date. Oh, fuck off, bro. Ota, are you okay? Yeah, totally. Oh, I don't want to get in your way. I should head home before I cause any more trouble. No, oh, stay not here. at all. You're fine right here. No, really, I should go. I'm sure that he has more fun with his friends than with me, so... Thanks, Mizuki. Huh? You came to visit me, right? Oh, yeah, right. It would be awkward to admit we are only here for the investigation. We're only here for the investigation, Oda. Yeah. I heard that you fought off the killer and saved Iris. That's so cool, Ota. You have a wound of honor. No, not really. Well, I guess a little. Calling Shut me up. a hero. It's kind of embarrassing. I didn't call you a hero. It is a good thing Iris was saved, but he's still irritating. Even more Fox. irritating is seeing cosplay in public. Have you heard about Iris? The nurse was talking about her a minute ago. That she's still in the ICU? Yeah, apparently the surgery went well, but she hasn't woken up yet. Hey, Ota. Next time we should fold a thousand paper cranes to wish that Iris will get better. Yeah, we could even make her a life-size crane. That would be a somewhat troublesome gift. Forget me. Are you okay? You passed out last night. Yeah, I'm fine. Are you concerned all of a sudden? I feel much better after a good night's sleep. It sounded like you were having a nightmare. You kept moaning something about... Reika. Reika. Seriously? Seriously. No, just what I told you yesterday. All right. You know, if you weren't in the hospital, I would slap you upside the head so hard you start remembering things again. Like shock therapy? Whoa, old school. I thought Abyss was more future tech than that. We are, but if it ain't broke, you can learn a lot from the past. I see. Maybe you should hit him. No, no. Hey. No way. Mizuki's Otis climbing the ranks. Being in bed all day. He's the type that gets annoying around women. Yeah, facts. So, we still don't know who the culprit is? If you remember anything at all, please tell me. Well, maybe that all depends. None of, nothing depends, my guy. If you remember something, tell me. If you could get me, say, 
Tessa's toothbrush oh, it might jog my memory. Are you really going to do this in front of Mizuki? It's fine. Mizuki proofreads the light novels I write. I'm sure she's used to it by now. What do you mean? She should be used read? to it. Lots of things, like. W wait, Mizuki, you don't have to tell him! What are you making a 12 year old read? It's fucking dishes. Yeah, clown. let's go. Wait, you two just got here. It's okay. We saw you. Now we can go. <sighs> we already have Ota's testimony. It is unlikely he has any further useful information. Right. Where to now, Date? Hmm. Let's see. Mama. Are we just doing a round of not learning anything? Is that what today is for? And all we are is wait on and all. We're probably so not learning anything from Mama here. We might not learn anything from Mama here, and then the car ride back to headquarters will get a call about the blood results coming in. That's probably the route I see. we're going for here. So. Ye. Hey, Mizuki. What's inside that backpack you always have on you? Why? I'm just curious. Well, water, they, dehydrated um, bread, chocolate, biscuits, a flashlight, a hand charger, Swiss Army knife, a candle, matches. Oh goddamn! Someone's ready. Triangular badges, a first aid kit, whistle, portable toilet, a plastic bag, duct tape, a grenade, a magnet, disposable hand warmers. Do you have an entire disaster relief kit in your bag? Did you say grenade in the middle of all that shit? Better safe than sorry. I'm ready for anything. Perhaps I misheard, oh. but wasn't there an illegal item in there? Right, a uh, Swiss yeah. Army knife. Yeah, I'll look the other way. Yeah, yeah. Good, good call, Dante. No, not at all. I see gay people on TV all the time, so it's not weird to me. The LGBT community is rich in sensibility, has excellent taste, and is full of talented artistic people. And they share a common struggle. It makes them more sensitive and capable of sympathy. That's why so many of them are kind and caring, and they choose how to live their lives on their own terms. It means they have a strong backbone. So because of all that, I really respect them. They're even kind of cool. Why does 12-year-old spit so much facts? And that means you too, Mama! Oh, I love it! Bravo! Six million yen to you! You can transfer it to my account. Sir. No, I am. You sure? You still look a little scared. A little? Ha ha, <laughs> <laughs> scaredy cat. <laughs> laughing at me. Yeah, because it was funny. I'm going to expose your browser history. What? Seven ways to take hey, home chill. a cabaret girl? Three minutes chill. with a married woman? Stop, chill. stop. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. God damn, Mizuki. Don't play hardball. I never got to tell you, but I think she's very cute. I could just eat her up. Um, okay. Oh, don't worry, sweetie. I only really want to eat men. <gasps> Date, what are you making me say? You said that on your own. Oh, come on. Isn't a gentleman supposed to cover for a lady's slip of the tongue? Who is the lady Mama is referring to? Don't ask me. Mama is a lady. I've looked into it, but I still don't have anything useful for you. The case is still as fresh as a young man's juices. What hey, yo. does that mean? I have no idea. Twelve-year-old in the room, Mama. Sorry, no idea. Damn, I thought you of all people would know something. I am an informant, but really dangerous information doesn't just come rolling in here. But I promise, I'll keep my eye out for anything. Please do. And if I find something, you have to take a bath with me. Absolutely mm. not. 
Well, then let's not let's yeah, not hesitate. Not? Because you take up all the hot water. That's your issue. I promise I won't. I'll even take the costume off. It's a costume? Costume? Mm-hmm. And I look good without it. Right. Thanks for the chat, Mama. Oh, leaving already? I have an investigation to finish, but I'll be back. You are so impatient, even though you take your time in bed. Don't say things like that. How do you know in that? bed? What does that mean? Um, we'll talk later about that. You don't need to know. Let's go. Keep Mizuki pure. All right, am I psychic? Do I know that we're getting a car call? Yes, we are. Betting on it. Mm. Dante, a call from boss. Shall I connect you? No, wait. Mm. If I take the call, Mizuki might ask questions. Are you talking to yourself again? Do you need to go to the hospital? Exactly. I can put it on speaker. Please. Date, are you with Mizuki right now? Yes, what's up? I need you to come to Abyss headquarters with Mizuki. I was just heading there. Did something happen? Yeah, the head office is here. They want to get information from Mizuki. We here at Abyss have her testimony, but the rest of the MPD wants to hear from her. They didn't get anything from her last time. They want to do an official questioning. This order comes straight That's a from the top. That's a negatory space writer. We don't have the power to say no. So, please. You heard her. I don't want to. I want to keep investigating. There's nothing we can do. We can't fight the power of the state. You are the power of the state. Abyss is a toenail on the foot of the state. As far as they're concerned, we don't really do anything, and we don't have any say in what they do. And any time we get too troublesome, they cut us off. Why? Stupid Dante. How is this my fault? No pout. This ain't my fault, kid. I'm not gonna get arrested and fired because I'm not bringing you to talk to people. Tell them you don't know shit five times and then we can leave. Sorry for the trouble. Don't worry about it. I'm just a slave to you anyway. Oh, come on. I don't treat you like a slave, do I? Just because I sometimes make you lick between my toes? Hey, yo, 12-year-old in the Ew, room. what? I didn't lick anything. Anyway, thanks, Date. And don't worry about Mizuki. I told HQ to take it easy. Mizuki, just make sure you behave and listen. It'll be over soon, don't worry. Besides that... Date, there's something I have to tell you. You have a message from one of the inspectors at the warehouse. Let's go, Kagami. Magami, something like that. Yeah, something like that. Kaniza? Oh, yeah, that's it. A message from Kaniza. Oh, he wants to give oh, you some yeah, information in person at the warehouse. Could he have... The blood results? I'll head over right away. Mizuki, you be a good girl, okay? Ugh. Jeez. All right, let's go see our best friend, Kaniza. I mean, our enemy, Kagami. I mean, I don't know. I'm scared because we're going alone and he has important storyline stuff, so he's probably dead and I'm going to be very sad. I mean, happy. I mean, I don't know. Hey, Date, sorry to make you come all the oh, way down thank, here. Thank well, I have the lot. results of the DNA analysis. What did you find? It's just like you said. There were two different blood signatures. One is definitely from Oda Matsushita. Other. Huh? Well, we got the results, but we couldn't find any matches in our database. What? So what is it number 89s then? Because he's not in any of the database shit? Or is it like is that is there someone that else? That is not surprising. HQ does not have a complete record of everyone's DNA. What now? What now? Do not panic. I have a piece of information I think you should know. 
What is it? I have discovered a suspicious person at your 12 o'clock. 200 yards. He's looking this way. Who's in the background person. there? This guy? Oh, oh little Dante. Me. Time for your medication. I said what 200 medicine? yards ahead. Ah, uh, nah, nah, nah. What is this shit? I don't like it. So? Is that so? That is so. That's so, Sejima. Leave it. Oh, his left leg. Fucker. Huh? So Sejima! Stop! <sighs> Damn it! Holy fuck, we just that oral it's drum him. weighs 44 so kilograms. Is the culprit. Calm down. We cannot yet make that conclusion. He was only dragging his left leg. But he's been all over this case so far. Shoko and Renju are both in bed with the Kumakuras. And the Kumakuras know so. And not just that. We saw him in Iris' Somnium. Still. And he has no alibi. No alibi for Shoko, Renju, or the warehouse. Got it. Calm down. The only thing we have so far is circumstantial evidence. We also do not have any established motive. Why would he That's kill true. We don't Renju? have a motive yet. Why would he cut out Iris's eyeball? Well... However, I do agree that so is suspicious. Do you agree with me or not? I am explaining to you that we currently do not have enough evidence to bring him in. Confronting him now would only result in him denying everything. We need direct evidence. Direct evidence. The criminal's blood from Give the me his blood storage results. warehouse. If the DNA matches So's. Right. We need to get So's DNA. The question is, how? Okay, so what we do, we hire Mama to go to his house and tell her that there's a special little boy waiting for her. And then, okay, let me stop. Um, in the first office? Hey, Iba, do you remember when we went to the Kumakura's office Sunday? Of course. Cigarettes? I am incapable of forgetting anything. Then let me ask you a question. I didn't think it... I didn't think it was going to be as simple as just saying his house, because she would probably say, nah, his house is on lockdown, he won't let us do what a shit over there. in front of the sofa? The cigarette butts. So was smoking yes, those sir. Exactly. And so's saliva might still be on the butts. If we have that, we have so's DNA. I mean, are we relying on the Kumakur's not throwing out his cigarette butts three days or two days later, however long ago it was in this timeline? Wait a moment. That was two days ago. The ashtray yeah, must have been emptied by now. But there's a chance. We have to at least try. Hmm. I agree. All right, let's head there. Mama, bail us out. Although in this timeline, I don't think we're friends with Mama. Kind of sad about that. Mama, Mama's a good friend. Weird little dude, but a good friend. Hey, what are you doing here? So on Girl Scout cookies. You fucking with us, old man? Date, don't bother. I know. Hey, where are the cigarette butts that were in here? Huh? The cigarette butts, from when I was here a few days ago. We threw them away, of course, dumbass. Where, dumbass? Why do you care about some cigarettes? I need them for the investigation of the new Cyclops serial killings. I see. Just last morning, I heard there was a new victim. I didn't watch it, but I heard something about it being streamed online. That's a lie. This man was glued to the screen watching his bay. Poor girl got one of her eyes cut out. I know that, idiot. Sorry. And you're yeah, here so for the investigation? It. Yes. So if I cooperate, it'll help you arrest this guy. Ah, uh, yes, Momo's on our side now that Iris has been had her eye removed. Alright. Look around as much as you want. Huh? 
That was easy. You said you were looking for cigarette butts, right? Yeah, the one So was smoking. So Sejima, you think he did it? No, nothing for sure yet. Hey guys, where's the cigarettes that were in here? Probably in the trash in the back, boss. Bring me the one that So was smoking. Yes, sir. I didn't the touch it. Ones. I'm being considerate, I see. But why did you bring four? There were a couple of other cigarette butts in the bin. I didn't know which one so smoked. MoMA? I don't remember. But so cigarette is definitely one of these? Yeah, it's gotta be. Date, the remember one. the brand that so was smoking? Right. He was sm Remember a rookie Klein. I remember. So was smoking a Klein cigarette. Correct. Let's return to Abyss. Pewter should be able to get DNA from it. Got it. Looks like you found it. Yeah, thanks to you. Nah, this was nothing. Anything. Tessa. Tessa? Ayo! We got it confirmed again. Did you just say Tessa? What, what are you talking about, you Neanderthal? I said anything for Tesseract. That doesn't even make uh, yes. sense. Shut up! If you're done here, get your ass going. <laughs> Alright. Whatever you say. The car to headquarters. I'm counting on you, Pewter. You can leave it to me. If the DNA on that cigarette butt matches the blood stain in the warehouse, there would be no doubt that So Sejima is our mysterious polar bear. How long will it take to analyze? Mm -hmm. If I had six hours... You've got three. <laughs> That's totally unreasonable. But I suppose... I will do my best to have this analyzed in three hours. You folded pretty easily on that one. I want to catch the criminal as soon as possible. That's all. Now, because time is of the essence... Excuse me. How is Mizuki, by the way? They finished questioning her. I had one of the officers take her home. She should be there by now. Good. So, Sejima. I can't believe it, of all people. We don't know that for sure yet. But you saw that his leg was injured, right? It's pretty damning evidence. Don't be too hasty, boss. You were saying the same thing earlier. Anyway, let's wait for the results. That will clear everything up. Yeah, you're right. I hope this won't be trouble. Trouble? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you got some shit going on with him. I know. You shot him to death in a different timeline. Hmm? Oh, we just skipping forward time? Okay. Computer. Is it true? The results are in? Yes. The DNA I collected from the cigarette butt is a positive match to the bloodstain from the warehouse. Let's go. Really? It was so all along. He was the polar bear. He carved out Iris's eye and stabbed Oda, and probably killed Renju and Shoko. Making so Sejima the new Cyclops killer. Thank you, Pewter. Don't thank me yet. Hurry up and get so. Yeah, you're right. Boss. Boss, listen. The blood stain in the cold storage warehouse. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Something about to go down. So she's just about to do something. I got a report from Pewter. Well, then you already know. I'm heading there right now. Heading where? Where else? To So's house. Date, I'm sorry, but you can't do that. What? Oh, my God. I can't let you get So. Boss, I don't understand. This comes from the top. 
So and the head office have been tightening it for 20 years now. They can't go against So's wishes. Fuck that's corruption that. and bribes to be sure, but there's also some kind of blackmail. Blackmail? So knows something. Something that the public can never know. If that secret got out, the authority of law would be thrown into question, and the entire police force would be at risk. So has something on HQ? Yes, almost certainly. That's why I can't let you go. Do you understand? Hell no. Is that why? Is that why you kill him in a different timeline? I see. Then I'm sorry, but I have no choice but to take you off this case. Hey, boss, come on. Are you serious? Are you serious? You gotta be kidding me! Are you sure you want to do this? You still have a chance to turn around. If you put your hands on so, you will never be able to return to Abyss. I don't care. I don't want to work for a rotten organization in the pocket of some politician. When this is over, I'll open a restaurant in Okinawa or something. Wait! Oh, should I make it a soba place instead? That's not what I mean. You have a video message. A video? Look! <sighs> Mizuki! Oh, for fuck's Shit. sake. Bro, if Mizuki's dead, I'm gonna be upset. Mizuki's never died before, I'm gonna be upset, upset. Like in a different fucking way. Mizuki! Mizuki! Where are you? Oh, thank fuck, she's alive. Don't worry, Under the bed, I'll bro. find you. Under the bed, bro. What? Really? She's behind the chair? I know. In the fridge? Outside? Date, perhaps Mizuki. Mizuki! Date, her! I know, I know. Oh, thank way. God, she's okay. I was about to suffocate, just so you know. <sighs> this is so typical. You're never there when you need to be. Just like six months ago, I was about to miss the bus, and you... <laughs> I actually stay like that for a while. Huh? <laughs> I don't believe this. <laughs> Not hurt. My mouth stings a little, thanks to you ripping the tape off my face. If I get fat lips from this, I'm gonna make you pay for cosmetic surgery. Don't girls want bigger lips, though? Hmm. <laughs> Three men. The doorbell rang and they said they were delivery men. I thought you had bought another one of your weird videos or something, so I opened the door. And they sprayed me with tear gas. Did you see their faces? No. They were all wearing masks. It is probable that they are working for So. They may be his bodyguards or hired thugs. It just makes me so mad. If they didn't get the jump on me, I would have... Pow! Bang! Bam! Wham! Mizuki, I have just one thing to say. Hmm? Never in my life have I bought any weird videos. That's what you wanted to say? <laughs> oh, sorry. Last clown. We identified the person inside the polar bear. 
The man who tried to kill Iris and Ota? Yes. And also, the man who killed your parents. Um... Well, we're kind of just speculating that. We don't actually necessarily have a link. Like, I mean, is it probable? Of course. Is it likely? Absolutely. Is it for certain? No. Who? Congressman So Sejima. So? Do you know him? Kinda. I've seen him on TV before. But why? I don't know why yet. But it was definitely his blood at the cold storage warehouse. I can't believe it. I'll never forgive him. I'll get him for this. Oh shit. Mizuki, I'm going to So's house now. Are you leaving me behind again? No, not anymore. <laughs> Grab your pipe. Even if I tried to leave you behind, you'd still come with me, wouldn't you? Grab your pipe, we're about to kick some ass. So are you ready? What should I be prepared for? Those bodyguards will be armed. It might get messy. Bring it. I'll put them in the ground. Don't kill them. We need him alive. And I need you to stay safe. Can you do that? Always. Always? Occasionally. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Date. You have to understand, he killed my parents. I saw their bodies with my own eyes. If I turn back now, I'll go crazy. I know, you don't have to say it. Let's go. Five minutes. Let's go grab MoMA too, grab the Kumakuras. I thought I played pretty far into this route before saying things are locked or anything. Thanks for the warm welcome. I came for so. Please take me to him. What are you talking about? He's sleeping and not taking any visitors. Go home. I'm sorry, but I can't do that. I'm coming in. I've always wanted to see this line. Nice punch. Well, let me use a line too. This is the end for you, chump. Sejima's orders, nothing personal. That's what I thought. Huh? You're so predictable. What? <laughs> From the heavens. The greatest super soldier. Nope. We're not even close to done yet. Look. They multiply. Bring it on. Let's do this. Kill them. Date. I'll take care of these guys. You get those, Date. Are you okay? Huh. Very specific. Shouldn't you worry more about yourself, old man? Jeez. I'm off. She has a smaller hitbox than Ash. There are numerous hostiles. Too many for you and your revolver to combat effectively. So what's the plan? Hmm. Mega mind.
Date, the island in the middle of the pond. Do you remember it? Yeah. Your favorite thing is on that island. My favorite thing? A porno magazine. What? Still don't know if I'm supposed to be spamming that or timing it or what. What? Shingon Super Saiyan no Jutsu? <laughs> Strikes? How are we doing that? Date, load evolver with wire bullets. What am I shooting at? Above us. Above us? What? No time to explain, just do it! Oh yeah. The fuck's a wire bullet? Crapple hook? Low mo action shot. Don't you mean surrender? Do it! Do it or we die! So those ones are easy, I just press that once. Their ass. What do you mean? Just watch. You will see in the seconds. Three, two, one. Ooh. That's a yikes. I don't. Uh, that seems like that will uh, possibly kill them. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest here. Okay. <laughs> you lied to me again. I have already explained this to you. If you hear the words "porno magazine." Your reaction speed increases by a factor of 3.6. That was more like a factor of like 12. Okay, we would have dusted Iris around the carousel if you told me there was a porno mag at the end. A rather convenient function of yours. Why wouldn't I take advantage of it? Damn it. How did you know about the lightning? Satellite imagery, atmospheric conditions, and other factors. However, I predicted the lightning would fall elsewhere, so I had you launch wire bullets to direct the lightning to the pond. Anyway, where's Mizuki? I will scan for her. <laughs> my eyes! My eyes! Mizuki! Mizuki? Wait for me! I'm... Don't hit her. Oh shit, we're actually That's in the mansion? Trace amounts of capsaicin in it. Mizuki appears to have been sprayed with tear gas. No. I have a like this the text for Mizuki's her? metal pipe. What? He is taking.
taking Mizuki hostage. Why is he so quiet? Shit! Date, look around. Mizuki must be nearby. Have you looked on the- Not yet, but I know there's another room back. There yeah. she is. Mizuki! That is so holding her. Son of a bitch is using her as a shield. Why isn't Mizuki fighting back? She does not appear to be conscious. I cannot determine why, but she is breathing. She is alive. I have to do something. Wait, don't move. Remember what So told you. That he can see us somehow. There may be a sensor or something similar in this room. Or I could just shoot him in the head. I would stop that line of thinking. If you shoot now, there is a high chance he will hit Mizuki. Then what am I supposed to do? Let me think. Galaxy brain. What bullshit are we gonna ricochet? No okay. shot, dude. Mode evolver with spherical bullets. Then we're gonna ricochet it through the pipe. Floor. Southwest corner of the room. Then, immediately shoot a spherical bullet at the pipe. No questions. There is no time to explain. You sure this will work? If you time it correctly, yes. Are you ready? Yeah. Go. Hell yeah. Bro, that shit. Why is she conscious now? Uh, no. Mizuki, move! What? No shot. Oh, bro. I protect Mizuki. I don't shoot him. Damn it. Did we get blinkied? Did we lose Aipa? Pathetic. Killed by your own father. By the way, do you like fireworks? What? Let me show you the most beautiful firework you'll ever see. But don't blink. It'll only be a flash. So's our dad? How do you like these fireworks? What? Ah. 
I just want to go to the cabaret club. Dying words of a legend. <laughs> what? W what? What did you say? Hey, quit fooling around. Come on. Date, get up. Hey. Hey. Date. 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 Hi, AI. What the fuck? I know even the best of us can be taken out of commission by a simple cold. No, no, no. Fuck that. What the hell? Are we winning? Routes are still classified. What the hell? But I always thought Date was above that somehow. Like a hero. A hero? Heroes are supposed to be invincible. Even if the odds are stacked against them, something miraculous happens to save them. That's what I thought would happen to Date. But instead, here he is. You make it sound like he's dead. <laughs> right. Sorry. Date has an artificial eyeball called an AI ball in his left eye socket. That's exactly hey, where So shot him. So it acted like a kind of shield. Iba saved us. Legend. Because of that, the bullet didn't go through his brain. It saved Date's life. The surgery to remove the bullet was successful, and now all we have to do is wait until Date wakes up. That's what was supposed to happen anyway, but instead... Instead what? Oh, that's Aiba. Aiba? Yeah, Date's partner. You saw him talk to himself sometimes, right? More like all the time. That was him talking to Aiba. Oh. It's strange, isn't it? The surgery was successful. No EEG abnormalities. But he still hasn't woken up. I think I might know why, but if I'm right, it's nothing any of this medical equipment can fix. The problem lies in his soul. His soul? Something's going on in his consciousness. Don't worry about that. It's true that Date disobeyed direct orders, but that order basically came from So himself. And he's not going to be a problem anymore, is he? Date won't get reprimanded for this. Oh, good. So also no longer has his hooks in the MPD. We can finally resume the investigation properly. Date is like a fat cat to me. Aww. Stupid. Idiot. Perverted old man. Hmm. All the evidence points to So Sejima. Thanks to Date, I think we can finally close this case. There might even be a promotion waiting for him after this. Are we sure about that, actually? He's lost somewhere in his own mind. There's a lot of loose ends not answered. Lost? He doesn't know the way back. Sinking over and over can have this effect. How can he find his way back again? Only one way I can think of. Maybe. Paging Miss Shizue Kuranushi. Shizue Kuranushi. Please Who's come to the nurse's station. Looks like I gotta go. I'll be back as soon as I can. What? Is that the boss's name? She's away Koronushi or whatever? 
That's her name? What? While I'm gone, keep talking to Date, okay? You might give him a reason to wake up. See you. Talk to him. Huh. Hey, Date. You're so stupid. You know that? Grade A, first class, king of the idiots. Why did you protect me? It was my own fault. I went into the mansion by myself, and then got tear gas sprayed at me by soap. He hit me in the back of the head and I blacked out. This was all my fault. Everything I did was a mistake, but you came to save me. You made me look like an idiot, you know. Oh, wait a minute. I get it. You wanted to scold me, right? After saving me, you're never gonna let me hear the end of it. You suck, Date. Big stupid jerk. Aw, she loves us. Okay, since we're alone, I'll be honest with you. Earlier, Boss said that you were like a hero, right? I think so too. Deep down, you're a hero to me. You raised me since I was eight. Even when times were hard or you were depressed, you were there for me. The past few days too. After mom and daddy, I was trying to act like it didn't bother me, but really, I was just holding it inside. Staying quiet, pushing my feelings down. And I just took it. I forced myself to be happy, but inside, it hurt so bad. Like I wanted to die. Sad and afraid and alone. My heart was about to break, but, but because you were there, I was able to fight it. You being there helped me be myself. But if you're gone, Date, I... Oh, we didn't get to do the Shizu Karyoshi line? Hey, Fuck. Date, wake up. Come on, wake up. What happened to your promise? You can't tell me you forgot. You promised, Date. We're supposed to eat ramen. Are you going to break your promise? You're not going to take me? That's not fair, Date. You liar! Yeah. And God's a liar too! I prayed at the shrine! I prayed that you wouldn't get hurt! But. Aww. Do you want to save Date? Yes. Then I'll finish my thought from earlier. There's one way we can bring back Date. Someone has to sink into his brain and guide him home. Someone? Mizuki, I need a favor. Let's huh? go! You synced with Date once before, right? Your synchronization levels were extremely high. You two are compatible for syncing. No one is more qualified than you. Please, please save Date. Okay. I'll try. Hey, yo. No shot. It's okay. Remember, six minutes. Do no way, dude. What? Stay so annoying. You told me a thousand times. All right. Mizuki. We're counting on you. Leave it to me. Mizuki? She's going in this shit without Aiba, though. I'll bring you back. I promise. Are you ready, Mizuki? Hmm. Then, let's begin. I mean, Mizuki's doing the shit without Aiba. Falls to the wall by herself. Ah! Hey, yo. This is my house, but it's in black and white. Is this what's inside Date's heart? 
You don't have Aiba to Date, help us where either. Where are you hiding, Date? Computer, his audio, the door, the wall, the kitchen. Ah. Is that Stu? Taste that shit. I'll try eating some. The vegetables and meat are cut too big. Are they always this big? Me? Why? Hey, Date! Everyone's waiting for you! Hey! Are you listening? Date? Don't be modest now. This is my special recipe. Eat it while it's hot. I don't know how I did it, but I think it came out pretty good. when I first came to Date's house. Date, what happened? Why this? The desk got colored. Memories of school? Date's cork board. Pretty picture of a river. Where is Akikawa Valley? I'd like to go there someday. Oh, well, that was bad. Date's one, I guess. Date's police. Okay, that's the least amount of time to do. Respect the badge. <laughs> yup. <sighs> Just testing what would happen. Not playing around or anything. Date's cork. No, I want to look at his. Date's cork. What? Why do I still have a two times on? What? Also, I want to look at his computer. Computer. Date's computer. Fuck, Date's two times. Date's computer. Memories of school? Turn it on. Power button, power button. Where is it? Well. <laughs> oh. Whoops. <laughs> Don't know my own strength. Date! Damn it, Mizuki. I broke your computer! You can't watch any more porn! You better come out and stop me! Date's That's not you have it. five minutes remaining, Mizuki. Date's police ID. Without this, no one would believe he's really a police officer. Leaving it around like this is how it gets lost. If I hide it somewhere, maybe he'll panic and wake up. Aw, uh, never mind. He's too dense to notice something like that. Date's okay, corkboard. the corkboard thing. I wonder what this note is. Side? Wop? Is this someone's name? A woman? I can't tell. Ugh, useless. Date's handwriting is trash. No, not nothing on the corkboard. Date's cork. 
Date's computer. Um. I don't want to use another. I don't want to have another two times. Ha! This is all your fault, Dante. Get up already. Still no. Dante's po. Dante, get up! Are you crazy? Jeez, what are you doing? Because you washed your old underwear with my clothes, dummy! Pervert! I gotta be more careful. If I keep this up, I'm not gonna get off with a warning and a pay cut. I remember this. You do? Well, you remember about it, kid. Date's quirk. This is the trash can. This paper. I'm gonna throw it away, okay? Hope it's not important. How can I get you to react, Dante? There's something about this trash can. A trash can. Four minutes, Mizuki. Are you all right? Fuck me, dude. Oh, maybe this. Hey, your school announced bring your parents to school day, right? Don't you have to tell Renju and Shoko? Wouldn't matter. Hmm. What should I do? Sorry for making you worry about me, Date. Yeah, we're a good parent, aren't we? Systems next. A shelf with record. The power supply. Is this it? Ha! Oops. Messed up again. Guess that's why Dante told me not to touch it. <sighs> I'm not getting all the stuff wrong, bro. Date, time for your food. Looks like that's not good. He wouldn't be here in the first place. The speaker. Bruh. I'm going to destroy all your electronics and stuff. Hope that's okay, Date. React to me. It's boring otherwise. A speak. Hmm. <laughs> That's. Mizuki. Mizuki. Hold on. I'll find you. I remember being mad at you because you took so long. But after I saw your face, everything felt better. It's at a... What am I doing? I don't want to throw him. He's my special friend. It's at a rabbit. It's at a rabbit. Right speaker. You have three minutes remaining. Be careful. Memories of gifts. Um, I get. I don't want to do the long one. <laughs> 
love my Atta Rabbit. It feels so warm and comfy holding it. How did you know that I would like it, Dante? It's at. Fuck. Atta Rabbit is kind of ugly. I mean, at the time I said it was ugly, but. Hmm. I hope this is okay. What if she doesn't like it? I'm home! Mizuki, uh, welcome back. What are you hiding? What's that? This? Oh, uh, I, I wonder. I was just thinking that this place looks awfully empty, right? Look, it's perfect right here. Hmm, ugly. Next. Memories of a bed. Time to burn the two times. It's my... <sighs> Sorry, Date, but I can't sleep anywhere but here. <sighs> Figuring out a dream is tough. What should I do next? Oto would have this cleared in seconds. Now that no, I think about he wouldn't. It, didn't I used to sleep on that sofa? When did that change? You have less than two minutes. Hurry, Mizuki. It's my bed. Underneath the bed. I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh, thank God. No dirty magazines. A lot of memories of the bed, but you know, you're just gonna not have anything. It won't open. Is Date inside? No, that's not it. The one inside was. A door? What? Why do I have like the worst timing on everything, bro? Suki, hey, I'm sorry about eating your pudding without asking. I'll buy you another one. Hey, come on, open up. I'm at my limit here. I really have to go. I'm gonna piss my pants. Mizuki, seriously, come on. Open the door! Memories of the bed. Date's I was sleeping here before, though. now. 
Okay. Fridge and coat. My true feelings. That tastes that is coat. This looks dirty. It smells like him too. Well, I'm not gonna wear it. I don't want to wear your coat, Date. That tastes. No, not it. Smells like that bar marble. Ugh. Uh, nope. You have less than one six now. To hurry. Huh. Probably because this is Dati's room. The fridge. God damn. I mean, the one six are making it easy so I can do all this stuff. I don't do good with tight Like, they're wasting a second each, so it's, it's fine. Food. Nope, I definitely need to use the timing. Maybe Date is flat under this. Doubt it. Wow, Adorata went totally right. flat. And disappeared. Date, what are you trying to tell me? Adorata isn't cursed, right? There's still a... Okay, I guess we kick it. No, it's not right. I'll do it when he's wearing it. That's much better. Hey, I got an extra sweet pudding for little babies. You can have it. Watch your mouth! Nice kick. Ah, oh, fuck. Throw it. I don't fucking know anymore. Now I don't throw it. I threw everything out the window, but not now. Oh my god. Huh. That's weird. Oh, I get it. It's because Dante doesn't know what's inside my bag. This is Dante's bag. Do you care about me or Fuck. not? My ah, school it's the charm. I knew it was the charm, but <sighs> This is from Ikume Shrine. Since we're here, let's go into the shrine. I told you, I don't believe in that stuff. Come on, come on!
Uh, are we gonna know what he drink? What he prays for? I wish that the Zuki grows up healthy and happy. Best parent, Date. What did you ask for? To leave this boring place as soon as possible. Dante, bro. Mizuki, you're out of time. Dante? Dante, wake up! Everyone is worried about you. You shouldn't come to me. Go be with your parents. What? Can't run to my parents, bro. Yeah. yeah, we're retrying. Um, I think I can make it from here. Was it sleeping? We got the door. Oh fuck, we're on our times two bullshit. Um, smell. Get rid of that. A door. Is it knocking. I think it was knocking. Yeah. Then we go to the sofa. You have less than two minutes. Hurry, Mizuki. Mom. Take his coat. is the best parent ever to leave yes, sir we did it I'm so confused. Uh, did I run out of time? Is that what it was? Maybe I should go to them first. Delete. spend that much time with you. From now on, I promise to play a lot more with you. Daddy? Nah, man. 
I can't do that. Oh, uh, what? It just gives me the game over if I do that at all? God. So I just have to go back to Dante again, I'm guessing. Okay. Let us speed run. Taste that shit. This time six, bro? Okay, that's something short. None of those. Lift. That's a times two, though. Corkboard. Fuck me, bro. Dante's what? Seventy two seconds. Ah, uh, fuck it. Zuki's in here. Yep. And that's the door. Are you alright? Ugly. Bedtime next. We burn the times two. On oh, smelling the bed. Then we go knock. Speed runs. I'm good. I got time to spare, my guy. Nah, talk to me again, bitch. Dante, please, wake up! I am not what you need. Yeah, you are. One more time. Nah. Nah, fuck my parents. My parents were shit. You have less than two hey. minutes. Hurry, Mizuki. My parents were shit. Mizuki. Thank you, Mizuki. Best dad daughter. Didn't even run out of time. Date A required. Let's go. I am going to probably end this as soon as I can. Um, to save for next time. What the? How did I 
get here. Dante! Hey, why the sudden affection? Because you're so stupid. Huh? <laughs> you're so stupid. I just want to punch you. Welcome back. Welcome home, Dante. Yeah, I'm home. Hell yeah. Is that the end of that route? Is that like the ending we're supposed to get? Skipping it because we, I mean, we both hit credits before. Oh shit, okay. Is this Stein's Gid? Did we do it? I was on her shoulder, that's adorable. Ah, uh, well. While I'm not sure this, I mean, it had credits, but I don't know if this is the end route and route um these routes are still locked <laughs> so i don't know um guess i'll play until this one can't be can't go any further or whatever and i'm guessing i have to go this way i don't know i don't know how else to progress those two that are locked um, i also don't know if this is the end of this route if we reached a good ending. There was credits that popped up, but now we have this afterwards, so... Find out next time. <laughs>